Hey my youth, you they know where you watch. Dance out! Wow, one people. Dance our skill are there again with some more things to talk to you about and I have videos that I'm going to present to you Big up and respect to each and everyone. I hope that everyone is okay and alright. That's it. Alright now first things first I am going to present a video to you that I'll be recorded within the country that is known as Jamaica I don't have any information as to when the video will be recorded The video shows some things that happened on the day when two persons had been arrested or detained by the police within the country that is known as Jamaica now, according to some things that a person said in another video that I saw on social media about the whole situation, I got the understanding that the person said that those two persons who had been arrested or detained by the police within the country that is known as Jamaica had been arrested or detained by the police within the country of Jamaica because they had old phones or an old phone in their possession. According to some more things that the person said in the video that I saw, I also got the understanding that those persons had been brought into police custody because they were not able to provide any receipt or receipts for those old phones or the old phone. Viewers and subscribers, I want to look at this video carefully and tell me what to think. You can tell me what to think about the whole situation overall. And please bear in mind that this video shows police officers and civilians. In the video, you can hear persons yelling and shouting. So before I present this video to you, this is a warning that some of the scenes in this video might not be suitable for everyone. Viewer discretion is advised. Here's the video. Take a look, listen, observe, and uh, tell me what you think. Nobody can tap me. If anybody tap me, I'm going to before them. I'm going to go people that situation they bring a higher awareness to me dance as killer yeah a higher awareness you understand yeah man you see because me is the kind of person of yours and subscribers you know me will buy a phone or me will buy something and me put down those receipts in the house somewhere and maybe after two or three months maybe even after a couple of weeks me don't know where the receipt they gone so right now, this whole situation bring a higher awareness to me, dancer as killer. The reason why I say higher awareness is because me know that it's good to have your receipt for anything that you buy, just for certain reasons. Like if the police them ask you where you get that, you have a receipt for sure. You see me I say, and it's good to have a good legal explanation for anything that you have in your possession. See, just in case because you may never know what can happen. You see. Yeah, but you know, and I really, if those two persons are innocent, viewers and subscribers, I only hope that uh, them can actually prove their innocence if they're innocent. You see me I say? I mean, I just see me see the video on social media, so I talk about the video. You see? And um, but I like if you tell me what you think about that whole situation. All right? But people, it's rough. But, um, Janu, I move on to another video. Now, the next video I'm going to present to you, my viewers and subscribers, had been recorded somewhere within the country that is known as Jamaica. I do not have any information as to when the video had been recorded. This video shows some things that happened when the police within the country of Jamaica stopped a motorist who was driving a motor vehicle somewhere within the country of Jamaica. Now, some comments on social media gave me the understanding that some persons on social media talked about how the police officer who you can see in the video behaved while doing his job. And I would like you, my viewers and subscribers, to take a look at this video and tell me what you think about some of the things that you're about to see and hear in this video. You can tell me how you think the police officer was behaving while doing his job. You understand? Now, please bear in mind that I can hear at least one harsh language in this video. And before I present this video to you, this is a warning that some of the scenes in this video might not be suitable for everyone. Viewer discretion is advised. Observe. Tell me what you think.
look clean. Nice. You're going like your bumble clots look going everybody else. Nah, me that's... tap you. Me tap you. I'm going ask you some question. Are you are you foolish you say I go with? So and you, you, you don't know where what you know see what me talk about. They say you have 17 tickets for your arrest. And so them say again, the QR of that thing. Yeah. There was not the person did Leave not say there was a warranty from his you Leave me alone. And delete the phone because I'm going to take it from you. Delete the video. That is not how yeah. delete the phone. <laughs> 70 no people, no sir. That no sound safe at all. I 17 me hear the policeman saying at the video, my people. See? Well, the people, you tell me what you think. Tell me if you think the police officer was behaving badly or what. You see me, I say? Or tell me if you think the police was just doing his job or what, viewers and subscribers. You see me, I say? 17. 17. Wow. All right. Anyways, I'm going to move on to a topic. Now, I got information that a man who goes by the last name of Hilton was shot and killed by unknown assailants shortly after he arrived at his house that is located within the parish of Westmoreland, that's within the country of Jamaica, on Tuesday night. See? Now, today is Wednesday, the 15th of June, the year 2022, and it is said that the man who goes by the last name of Hilton was shot and killed on a Tuesday night, viewers and subscribers. See? It is said that Hilton is in his 30s. And it is said that Hilton was shot and killed by unknown assailants after he arrived at his house or his home with his family. It is said that residents within the area stated, and I'm going to say allegedly, that Hilton's killers hid in a corner near Hilton's house or Hilton's home and waited for him to arrive. Now, viewers and subscribers, I got more than one information as to what happened after Hilton arrived at his house or at his home. I got uh, informations that are somewhat different because I got one information that Hilton was about to step out of the motor vehicle when gunmen attacked him. And I got another information that Hilton stepped out of the motor vehicle then gunmen attacked him. And I also got information that Hilton's body was found under a tree in front Hilton's yard. See? So I'm just getting information as to why I got them. It is said that a resident within the area said that uh, the female who was in the motor vehicle with Hilton ran out of the motor vehicle, leaving the kids behind, and then later on went back for the kids and viewers and subscribers. You understand? And it is said that uh, the Jamaica Constabulary Force Cooperative Communications Unit said that Hilton was shot and killed by unknown assailants see so in my point of view based on the information that i got it seems as if the police confirmed that that happened you understand i also got information about a garage at the house viewers and subscribers you understand and i didn't get any confirmed information as to what might be the cause for the killing of the person who goes by the name of hilton you see yeah and viewers and subscribers why just please bear in mind that the information that I got about the whole situation, they are not exactly the same. So I say they are somewhat different. Is it? So I just uh, give them accordingly. But anyways, um, let me see if we can give you uh, some more information that I got about this whole situation as well. All right. Now reports from the Bethel Town Police Station are that sometime after 8:15 p.m. that would be Tuesday night, viewers and subscribers, and that would be the 14th of June, the year 2022. See? It is said that uh, the police said that Hilton arrived home and was about to exit his motor vehicle when he was attacked by men armed with firearms. It is said that he was shot in the head and upper body. He was taken to a hospital where he was pronounced dead. See? So it is said that Hilton's cousin, who identified himself as a certain name, viewers and subscribers, said that. He had been a family man. You understand, viewers and subscribers, mean that um, the cousin that talked about um, the person who goes by the last name of Hilton would die. You understand? See, so, you know, viewers and subscribers, I get information according to I got the, those information. See? See it? And, um, I don't know. I don't know what really and truly are going on in Jamaica, but it's just rough. It's just rough for people. I tell you, it's just rough. You understand? Right? Anyways, I just give information according to what I got. 
I have some of left with number people. Big up and respect to each and every one. Until next time, my name is Dan Saskia. I'm big up on yourself, you see? Hey, my you, you know where I watch? Dan Saskia!